stage two tanks pressing the flight pressures. Everything is go. The water deluge system is activated. Everything looks normal. T minus 30. Three seconds before launch, the Merlin engines will be commanded to ignite. T minus 20. T minus 15. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 6 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. And liftoff. The Falcon takes flight, propelling the Deep Space Climate Observatory on a million-mile journey to protect our planet Earth. GCOSM moved to section 10.65. Perhaps HPU is active. Beautiful asset. seconds after liftoff, the Falcon 9 will reach supersonic speed. 50 seconds into flight now. Falcon 9 basking in the glow of a sunset. Altitude 6.5 kilometers. Downrange distance 1.3 kilometers. Speed 599 meters per second. Recovery as acquisition of signal. Standing by to pass through the maximum di aerodynamic is pressure. Supersonic. Falcon 9 is supersonic. Vehicle First has reached propulsion. maximum aerodynamic pressure. First stage prop is still nominal. Everything go. Power and remain nominal. Falcon and Discover passing through max Q. is chilling in. Two minutes into the flight of Falcon Vehicle and Discover. on a nominal trajectory. Altitude 33.9 kilometers, downrange distance 20.9 kilometers, speed 1468 meters per second. Standing by for the first stage engines to shut down. First stage cut off in about 23 seconds. Vehicle remains on a nominal trajectory. Altitude 57.9 kilometers, downrange distance 50.0 kilometers, B2350 meters per second. We have Miko 1. And we have main engine cut off. confirmed. Second stage engine. Ignition. And we have stage 2. Engine ignition has occurred on time. The Falcon 9 Merlin vacuum engine producing 92,000 pounds of thrust, continuing to carry Discover to its place in space. Standing by for the fairing jettison. This will expose Discover to space for the first time. And we see a good fairing jettison. Stage two propulsion is still nominal.
power and telemetry is still nominal. Four minutes and 15 Out. seconds into flight. Kilometers down range distance, 215 kilometers, vehicle speed, 2303 meters per second. Beautiful view of the first stage, the two fairing sections, and the rocket. The first stage engine in the uh, lower portion of the picture, the two fairing sections flying just to the left. And above the Falcon 9 second stage, Everything continues uh, per the timeline. Second stage engine cutoff expected in. 130 kilometers, downrange distance 320 kilometers, vehicle speed 2313 meters per second. About uh, three minutes and 15 seconds away from second stage engine cutoff. Stage two propulsion is still nominal. A AFCN AOS. Power and telemetry still nominal. Six minutes, seven seconds after launch. Altitude, altitude 99 kilometers, downrange distance 417 kilometers, vehicle speed 2449 meters per second. Beautiful view of the second stage engine doing its job, propelling Discover into space. This engine will burn for another two minutes, four seconds. We have stage one entry startup. Seven minutes into flight. Second stage FTS has been saved. Stage two prop is still nominal. First stage FTS has been saved. Altitude 191 kilometers, downrange distance 813 kilometers. Uh, vehicle speed 5615 meters per second. Stage one entry shutdown. Seven minutes 45 seconds into flight. A little under a minute left in the uh, second stage engine burn. Thirty seconds remaining in this burn. Eight minutes, eighteen seconds into flight. Standing by for second stage engine cutoff. We have Seco one. Eastern range, loss of signal. And Seco 1, second stage engine cutoff number 1 has occurred on time. This will begin about a 22 minute coast phase. After which the second stage engine will ignite again. 
That'll occur about uh, 30 minutes, 10 seconds after launch, and that second second burn of the second stage engine will be a 58 second burn, which will uh, place Discover exactly where it needs to be to begin its uh, mission headed toward the Lagrange point, a million miles away from Earth. This is Discover Launch Control at 10 minutes, 30 seconds after launch. Everything has gone picture perfect. An on-time liftoff and all the mission events so far have occurred on time. We're in the middle of a 22-minute coast phase.